In part D of that question, we're told the predicted population in Avalon at the beginning of 2011 is this number here. So we're asked to write down and solve an equation in K to show that K is equal to this. So I'm going to go back to my original. So the population in Avalon, so it was given by this and in years, so in the functions above, t is time and t equals zero is the beginning of 2010. So beginning of 2010. So our function is, uh, so it's q t is equal to 3.9 e k t by 10 to the power of 6 and t equals 0 is beginning uh, of 2010 so at the beginning of 2011 t is going to be equal to 1 so t equals 1 start of 2011 so in this case we know what it overall is equal to and we know that t is going to be equal to 1 so it's 3.9 e uh, k multiplied by 1 by 10 to the power of 6 and that's equal to this number here so 3709795 oh, and um, so what we're gonna do here I'm just gonna leave that k by itself so 3.1 e k by 10 to the power of 6 is equal to 39 3709 seven nine five so now what i'm gonna try do is i re rearrange this so that i get the the expression that has the log by itself so i'm multiplying by 10 to the power of 6 on this side so i'm going to divide on the other side so 3.9 e k is equal to 3 seven oh nine seven nine five divided by 10 to the power of 6 so I get 3 So then when I do that, I get 3.9 EK is equal to 3.709795. So now I want to get E to the power of K by itself because with exponent an exponential, so the natural exponential, I want to just get this by itself. So I'm going to divide both sides by 3.9. So 3.709795 over 3.9 so when i have an expression like this i'm not able to solve um it for k right now because it's e to the power of k but i can rearrange this to get a log if i have an equation in the form of so the way i can move from an exponential to a log if I have an equation in the form log a x is equal to y we can write that as a to the power of y is equal to x so in this case we're starting off in this case our a is equal to e our y is equal to k and our x is equal to this so it's going to be log of e and then what goes next is our x so this bit here so 3.709795 over 3.9 and that's all going to be equal to k and log of e we can also write that as the natural log so i'm gonna work that out so three point nine seven nine five over three point nine and then we get that k is equal to minus zero point zero four nine 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 
and if we were to round that to two decimal places, k is equal to minus 0 0.05.